Hey guys, today we're going to be looking at commissions. We're going to answer what does commission mean and how can it be calculated? So a fixed salary is an amount paid regularly for work done. It does not change on a regular basis basis. Commission is an amount of money that a person earns for selling something. It's usually a percentage of what was sold. In some jobs, people have that fixed salary and can earn commission in addition to their salary. So let's take a look at number one. It says Michelle works at a shoe store and it receives a base salary of $400 per week plus 10% commission on her sales. She made $650 in sales this week. So let's find her commission first, which would be 10% of her $650 in sales. So we would do $650, $650 times 0.10 to figure out her 10% commission. And 650 times 0.10 is $65. So that means her commission was $65. Now to figure out her total payment for the week, we would do her $400 plus the $65 in commissions that she made. So that would be $465 for her total payment. Okay, let's look at number two. Alex is a realtor. He, see, he receives a base salary of $3,000 per month plus 6% commission for each house he sells. In March, he sold one house for $500,000. So the first thing that we want to do is figure out his commission, which is going to be 6% of that $500,000 house that he sold. So we would do 500,000 times 6% would be 0 0.06. So 500,000 times 0 0.06 is 30,000. So his commission on what he sold in March would be $30,000. And now we want to figure out his total payment. His base salary is $3,000. So we would do 3,000 plus the 30,000 that he got in commission and we get $33,000. So his total re or his total payment would be $30,000. Okay, let's look at number 3. It says Michael is a car salesman. He receives commission at a rate of 25% when he sells a car. He sold a car for $20,000. How much commission did he get for this car sale? So we just want to figure out his commission. We won't have to add anything back. We just need to figure out 25% of $20,000. So I would do 20,000 times 25%, which is 0.25 as a decimal, and 20,000 times 0.25 is 5,000. So he would get $5,000 commission. Okay, let's look at number four. Teresa sells wedding dresses. She receives 20% off the sale in commission, 20% of the sale in commission when she sells a wedding dress. How much commission would she get for a dress? That is $1,800. So we just want to figure out the commission. We don't have to add anything back. The dress was 1800 and she gets 20% commission of that. So we are going to do 1800 times 0.20 to figure out her commission. So 1800 times 0.20 and we would get 360. So her commission for that sale would be $360. Okay, let's look at number five, Leanne sells pianos. She receives a weekly paycheck of 250 plus 30% on the pianos she sells. Last week she sold one piano for $10,000. How much did she make in total last week? So after I find the commission, I will need to add it back to her base salary. So let's figure out her commission. She sold one piano for $10,000 and she's gonna get a 30% commission on that. So we would do 10,000 times 0.3 to figure out her 30% commission. 
and 10,000 times 0.3 is 3,000. So she made 3,000 in commission, but I wanna know what she made in total. So now I'm gonna add the $250 back to it. So she would get in total $3,250. Okay, and number six, it says Chris works at an electronics retail store. He receives a weekly paycheck of 350 plus 15% commission of any computer sales he makes. Last week, he sold two laptops that were $900 each. How much did Chris make in total last week? So the first thing I wanna do is figure out his commissions. He sold two laptops that were $900 each. So 900 times two is 1800 so his total sales were 1800 and he's going to get 15 percent commission of that so i'm going to multiply the 1800 times 0.15 so 1800 times 0.15 is 270 dollars so he made 270 in commissions but we want to know how much he made in total so we will take his commissions and add his weekly paycheck of $350 to it. So 350 plus 270 would be $620. So he would make $620 in total.